Welcome to Abu Dhabi. We're just about to start today's race here at the Yas Marina circuit. It's a track known for its long, long back straight, which serves as a fantastic opportunity for overtaking, going into the slow speed corners that follow it. The drivers will be racing here at the Yas Marina circuit through 16 corners and a lap distance of around 3.28 miles. There are a few opportunities to pass with long straights and DRS zones in two places. So plenty of close racing, then plenty of speed and plenty of drama to be found in the laps ahead. Ladies and gentlemen, F122 is here. And what better way to kick off the brand new year of Formula One than with a time trial around some of the new circuit updates that we've seen for F1 22. And today, ladies and gentlemen, we are going to be starting in, of course, the World Champions car in the brand new Red Bull Oracle car. And, of course, we're going to take Max Verstappen's Red Bull all the way back to the updated version of Abu Dhabi and uh, show you guys how the circuit looks now that it has changed in the game and hopefully do some justice. Have it, Make sure we can wrap up a good lap as well. I won't lie to you. I have done a little bit of practice around here so far, and we have had this build for a little bit. So, massive thank you to EA Sports for that there. And here we go. We're in the garage, and uh, setups have changed Ever so slightly, because in the aerodynamic department now, your wings can go all the way up to 50. So, I'd, uh, it's, it's a bit of a, it's a bit of an interesting one. Uh, I, I shan't lie to you. I'm going to go on increased speed. And let's just go out of the flying lap, shall we? And let's see what we can do. So, of course, everything's different. It's, I mean, in the daytime, Abu Dhabi is not really what you want to see. But here we go. Our first proper video lap around Abu Dhabi. And at the minute, there are some assists on, which, uh, yeah, yep. Yeah, don't scream at me too much. I don't really want these on either, but they come on by default in this build of the game. Um, so, let's go. And, of course, I've come off the gas a little bit there. And here we go. This is the first part that has changed. No more chicane, ladies and gentlemen. Goes all the way up to the top, breaking harshly. A nice, nice little swoop. I've actually done that better than my uh, my other time trial lap that I've already done, which is quite nice. Getting a lot of time in a straight line on uh, default four. Let's see. Can we hook this one up, though? Let's have a look. Obviously, I'm not a professional at this game. I do have the arrows on. A little bit of oversteer coming out of here as well. But it feels good. The engine of this Red Bull sounds very, very nice indeed. And, of course, coming up to the second change here. No more zigzag. Coming into another very fast left-hander. Come off the gas a little bit and foot to the floor. We're off. Purple sector two. It actually looks like I'm going to set a better lap. That's a, not quite the entry I wanted there. And we come to the Nicholas Latifi corner, is what we're going to call it this year. Any Mercedes fans? I'm sorry. Right. Oh, here we go. Of course I invalidate. Of course I do. It wouldn't be a lap for me without invalidating and then completely losing all my time in Sector 3. Let's try and go for one more lap. Let's see if I can beat my time overall. And I think we're going to gain massively in the straights rather than uh, corners. So is preset 4 going to be nice and healthy for us? Who knows? We just need to try and do as best as we physically can on the corners. And try and get a good exit. And we've had not a terrible one there. We're going to gain probably a tenth, maybe a tenth and a half going down this first straight. But one thing going after last year, this is not a review or anything like that. This is like first impressions of the game. And of course, this is not the complete build either. So things are obviously subject to change. Oh, that's a lot of oversteer. Oh, dearie me, we've almost lost the car. And my personal best has overtaken me. You really do hate to see it. But one thing's for sure... This track has just become a lot more fun for online lobbies, and I can't wait to jump online with a few of you guys in the Twitch stream and have a and have a good race around here with the uh, with the updates, especially here. The next two videos that we're allowed to do uh, is going to be the updated version of Australia, and then we will go to Spain because, of course, Sector Three has changed ever so slightly as well. So we'll do all three of the updated tracks to show you guys what the change is, what they feel like in the game, my first opinion of it, and impression. It's a terrible lap, but we haven't invalidated at the very least. I've almost lost the back end of the car again. But overall, not too bad whatsoever. It feels really, really fun to use. Uh, I need to improve at this game. I need to try and work out how the setups work and all that good stuff. But there you go. 
That is Abu Dhabi done and dusted. We'll see you guys for another upload tomorrow where we will upload Australia.